that's a good round in it come on let's Aussie kid I'm going in going in Aussie kid playing too mental <laughs> can't tell me I'm not playing too hard come on let's Bro, Aussie kid match like I'm a not locked in, in Aussie in. yes sir Aussie tell him G too mental. too mental in it bruv <laughs> yeah no Ali it's not my last fight hard. it's just the week schedule last fight now Aussie's playing hard right now and of now Aussie's playing hard right now and of <laughs> yo 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 it's Aussie kid here today I got another episode of Aussie Peaches in me this one right no way some Nate Diaz in it I don't even know who this is Gene Silva who the hell is that I don't know this is what this is what you've all been waiting for Nate Diaz for the scene the stats I don't even know I don't even know who took that before we continue with the video please use the link in my description to sign up for gamersaloon.com you can either download the app for Gamer Saloon on your mobile device or you can use it on a PC and Gamer Saloon allows you to wager people on UFC 4 or UFC 5 and they also have other games like Sparking Zero and Undisputed when you use my referral link, you're going to get 50% extra bonus cash on your first deposit. 
and bonus cash is money that you're gradually going to acquire as you keep wagering people on the website. Gamer Saloon is 100% legit. I've made thousands of dollars from using it. And when you withdraw your money from Gamer Saloon, it goes straight to your PayPal account. And I just want to address something because there's a big common misconception that you have to be really good to wager people on Gamer Saloon. And that's what I hear from everyone. Whenever I tell them to use the app, they say, oh, no, I'm not good enough here. But this is not true. Anyone can use Gamer Saloon no matter how good you are. It's just about being tactical and picking your opponents wisely. And I'll show you guys exactly what I mean. I'll show you guys like what you what you got to do when you navigate the app and stuff like that. I'll show you guys what I mean now. So this is what I mean, guys, when I'm saying if you're just tactical, anyone can wager no matter what your level is. It's just about finding someone that's on your level or someone worse, which is simple. So what you do, go to find the match and then search for the game that you want to play and the console that you're playing. So for right now, let's do PS5 for UFC 5. And PS5, go to UFC 5. And now it's just showing you all the recent players for the game that you searched. So it's telling me there's 15 people that, that played this recently. And it's showing me a list right here. It's showing me the 15 people right here that played it recently. And all you've got to do is click on their profile and then you can see their record right here. So it says that this guy's got 88 wins and 49 losses. But you have to go to games played. So it specifies like their record for each individual game. So, so here, we're, so we're looking for UFC 5 PS5. And it tells you that on that game, he's 0 and 2. So someone like this, that someone like this, I can probably beat because he's, you know, he hasn't even won one match yet. So someone like this, I'll be willing to play. So I'll send him a challenge. I'll send him a $10 challenge. And I'll send him a message. I'll say to him, do you want to do the $10 challenge that I sent you, bro? And then that's it. And then you talk to him, set up the match. And then let's let's do two more examples. And let's, let me show you two more examples. This guy here, he doesn't have, you know, his, he hasn't played a match yet. He doesn't have no wins and he has no losses. So someone like this, you're a bit wary. You might be a bit wary of him. You don't know his skill level. We don't even know if he's good or, or if he's bad. And then if you start, if you go and look, look at someone else and they have uh, 30 losses and one win, then that's someone that you will be willing to play. And stuff like that. And then you also something else you gotta check. And I'll show you guys one more example. Now, for example, pretend you're looking at my profile. It says that I'm 19 and 3. I've got 17 wins and zero losses on UFC 5 for PS5. And then on Xbox, I'm two and three. So someone like me, someone like me, you, you might want to stay away from because you think, oh, you might think, oh shit, this guy is really good. But another thing I want to tell you guys is you need to also pay attention to this where it says it shows you when they reset their record. In this on this app, you can pay ten dollars and reset your record. So you need to also see if they've reset their record uh, recently because, for example, someone might be two and zero, oh, but if they reset their record like two days ago then they might have been 30 and all before they reset their record. So you also need to be wary of stuff like that as well. So that, so you guys probably, so that's it lads. So that, that's it lads, simple as that. So guys, you need to get involved. Everyone get involved. Don't matter how, doesn't matter what level you are. There's always going to be people to play. And I'm, you know, someone like me that's been using the app for several years, like you play people on this app that are literally clueless, like, they get countered by the same thing like 10 times, you know, there's, there's easy money to make on this app. Like, so everyone needs to get involved. Like, why are you going to, why are you going to put in two hour sessions and make uh, on UFC five and make no money out of it? Let's you start using this app, actually start making money when you're playing the game. Let's yeah. This is, this is, this is like, this is like one of the most fun ways that you can make money. So everyone, so everyone needs to get involved.
looking like it's the downfall now in me. Three piece. Steven, see the uppercut cross hook. Who? Oh. Great. Let's see if it shows it in the replay, even though I highly doubt it. Let's see. With that. Bang. 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 Woo. Do the. Yeah. That's 10 out of 10. In. Oh, that's a sick replay right there, you know. Has to be the best replay in the game. Well, I thought the guy was gonna pick Sam Alvey. I was gonna say no, he picked Paul Cray. I don't even know if he picked him on purpose. Probably did. Violated his auntie in it. This one right here is some live commentary for the lads. So let me pick some Ankalai. I know this Nikolai guy. And I have got the dirtiest crossing scene.
You ready to fight? You ready? Let's do it.
Right. Let's see what the judges were. The scorecard was. Let's see what the scorecard was. Might have won that if I just survived for the rest. Eric, I would have lost. Yo, yo, I ain't been like that Cause I live man's run never fib like that Chat shit but I ain't been like that Chillin' gym man's back cause I win that clash Stacking cash so high My track is slapped from man Don't try, don't react to chat And that's no lie No point chatting back I slack no time Yo, I ain't been like that